Hey guys, I just wanted to make a quick video and put out this public service announcement. You can actually go back to the old vanilla versions of Scarlet Monastery, all thanks to the Headless Horseman event that's going on right now in Retail World Warcraft. That means you can actually go back there and farm old items that were once unobtainable. And we don't know if this is going to be just a timed event or if this is going to be something permanent going forward. But either way, I wanted to get the word out really quick so you guys can start farming the items in Scarlet Monastery and get all of those awesome items. And real quick before we actually get into it, be sure leave a like on this video and subscribe to the channel so that you guys are always one of the first to see when my new videos go live. Nice. So this is actually pretty easy to obtain. All you guys have to do is just queue up for the Headless Horseman event and kill the Headless Horseman. What you're looking for here is an item called the Scarlet Key and this is going to have a chance of being looted out of the loot filled pumpkin that drops off the boss. Just keep in mind that the loot filled pumpkin is a reward that you can only get once per day per character. From what I'm told the Scarlet Key item is actually a pretty low drop rate but I am hearing some unconfirmed reports that if you actually activate the hard mode, yes, this fight has a hard mode, you actually have a higher chance of getting the key. So I would just recommend automatically just activating the hard mode every time you do this fight. And to activate hard mode is actually really easy. As soon as you zone in, there's going to be four wicker statues to the left of you. Just talk to the big wicker man statue in the middle and click yes, and that will activate the hard mode. Once that's active, head over to the boss, spawn him and kill him. I don't know what the drop rate is as far as activating hard mode. However, as soon as I did that, my first kill, I got the key. So once you have the key, head over to Scarlet Monastery in Tears Fall Glades, and as soon as you walk up the stairs on the left, kind of hanging on the wall, there's going to be a key ring. Just click on that, turn the quest, and then click on it again to activate the buff. Now, once you have this buff, you can go into all of the Scarlet Monastery dungeons and zone in, and you're gonna be zoning into the vanilla versions of them. And now you are free to just go and farm these dungeons to your heart's content. Here's a quick list of all of the items that drop off the bosses from the vanilla dungeons. And the best way to farm these is just go in there, clear everything out, zone out, reset the instance, and rinse and repeat. And one really nice quality of life feature that Blizzard has put in here is that you only need to loot the Scarlet Key on one character and activate it. I flew over to Scarlet Monastery on another character that had not looted the key yet, and I was able to click on the key ring on the wall and get the buff. So there you guys go. Now you can go back to Scarlet Monastery and get some items that you were missing for the longest time, years now. I think this is really cool that Blizzard's done this, and I really hope they do stuff like this in the future. Sound off in the comments section which items you're hoping to get from going through these old dungeons. And again, real quick, we don't know if this is a timed event or if this is going to be something that's permanent going forward. So I would say just assume that it's a timed event for the whole Halloween thing, which means do this now rather than later. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. I'm still solo and I'll see you guys next time.